We bury more eggs. Mm -hmm. Now it's time to put the beans and the oil. You see, you see, it's beautiful. Ah, oh my god, eat this. Let's close it up. Oh my god, it's so hot. I love this. So we have everything here. And now, <laughs> how is this gonna fit in my mouth? Oh my god. Hi everyone, hope you are having a wonderful day. It's a beautiful day. It's another day to try some street food. And right now we are at Olon Ayo Food Canteen before Federal Housing Estate. It's Ilega. So if you are somewhere around Abelkuta and you want to try some street food, come here. Especially when you are around Shaje, Elega, Aziz. Come try it here. Let's go. Now, and this is the beautiful woman that has been doing this for a very long time. Now we'll be trying rice. She has rice, beans, pork, bread, egg, plantain. So let's try everything. All right, let's start with rice. All right, rice. Uh, 300 yes okay and go for two eggs meat 1000 look at how beautiful those two is looking you see the oil everywhere, beautiful meat. Oh my god, this is lovely. Yeah, so Airbus put some stew there. Okay, okay, yeah, put stew there. Then we'll be taking bread as well. So we have some bread here. So let's take this one. How much is the bread? This one, 200 each, right? Okay. Let's take 200 bread. We need beans. Beans. Okay. There is plantain. Put plantain beside it. How much is that? Put everything. That would be how much how much is that spark? 150 or yeah, put beans hundred. So now we want another separate beans, 200 naira beans for the bread. There is this way they sell rice and beans here. So rice and beans will be separate and then there is beans specially made for bread. It's something that you will love when you are eating beans. It won't be just like, you know, like this one. It's, it's not matched together. But when it comes to the one you're going to use for bread, it's going to be matched together. And it's going to be food stew and meat again. That beans is made for bread. So when you want to eat bread, you want to eat it this way. Put uh, uh, two more. And this is how food are being served in most restaurants in the yoruba part of nigeria so you have basically you have the rice you have beans you have spag you have varieties these are meat plantain and if you don't know plantain you need to know plantain mm. Mm. delicious bread. Uh, this bread is meant for these beans you see it's different and the most beautiful thing is this oil you know 
when you want to eat and everything is like this, oh my god, you're gonna love it. Mm. Mm. Let's dig in. The first bite is the best bite because when you are hungry and you want to eat and you'll be like oh my god mm. Mm. I love this Mm. Now let's try the egg, the plantain, plantain is one of the favorite thing you want to put in your food, a lot of people in Africa, especially in Nigeria will love plantain. Mm. I know people that their best food are just plantain and fried egg. When you ask them what's your best food, they tell you plantain and fried egg. So now we have egg, we have plantain. Mm. Mm. This is the kind of food you just want to keep eating every day. You just want to keep eating it every day. Like every day. Mm. Now let's try bread and beans. You can do it this way. And put meat there. You see? It is lovely. And you just do this. Mm. Mm. This is delicious. You see, the meat is still there. You can put more bread and uh, more beans. Mm. Mm. So, the thing missing now is water, <laughs> and now we get water. So you need to drink water, you know. Let's try something else, something unique, something different. So we have bread. We have bread. We put in the nice meat here. Look at this flat one. Let's bury it here. Put plantain, three plantains. We have egg. We have eggs. We, post <laughs> we bury more eggs. Now it's time to put the beans. And the whole, you see, you see, you see, this is beautiful. This is this is lovely. This this is lovely. Ah, how am I going to eat this? Let's close it up. Oh my God, it's so hot! I love this. So we have egg, we have plantain. So we have everything here. And now, <laughs> how is this going to fit in my mouth? 
Oh my god! No, no, no. Let's go. Keep going. We are planting. Ah. 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 Mm. Mm. This is lovely, this is beautiful. I love this. Mm. Let's go back to the rice. Yeah, for the rice, we still need more stew. Mm. We have egg. Let's go with the the spag, the beans. You know, you have to mix everything. Mix everything together. Mm. 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 Okay. So let's just pause this for now. Let's dig in with the rice. Let's just the rice is one of the most lovely food around the world. Mm. 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 This is the general stew and it's so lovely, it's so tasty that whenever we want to eat rice in Nigeria, this is the stew we use. You want to eat rice, you want to eat spark, we use a stew like this. So when you want to try swallow, there's a separate stew for that. Mm. Mm. There's no way you want to do it, you can't get enough of plantain. A meat will always go with any rice, it makes it delicious, tasty, and you know, wonderful. The combination of everything in your mouth is just superb. So guys, this is lovely. And now to the next stage. It will be almost the same thing. It will be rice. But it's this young girl who her mom prepare rice and whenever she's 
back from school she walks around to assist the mom in selling them so i can't wait i think she sells rice spark beans and meat you know i can't wait to try it let's go uh we've been going about with the day i just show you guys my farm and this beautiful afternoon we decided to try a street food so there is this beautiful lady that do bring food around so we are going to try it today she brought a lot of food i told her bring a lot of food and we're going to try it and we're going to try a lot of meat Okay, then we, we still have beans, right? Good beans. I love the way you shape your beans. Look at the shape of the beans. How much is this beans? 15. How much is rice? 100 naira. 100 each, and this one is 15 naira. Look at the beans. Oh, yeah, pour it there. You have spark too, right? How much is that as well? 15 naira. Yes, put this one here. Yeah. All right, meat now. Wow. Put egg here. How much is meat? 15 naira. 50 each. Oh, yeah. Keep putting. I don't want that one. No. So, the beautiful thing there is that you can select meat. Put all these ones now. Making three. Uh, count to. Making three. Oh, nine. Yeah, I put down. Then. Then add stew. A lot of stew. Yeah, this is nice. Whoa. This is lovely. Okay. How much are you going to sell there? How much do you want? Oh yeah, how many men do you want? Three. So on Saturday, when, when you're coming, tell your mommy that you want good meat. A lot of good meat, not the hard one. This pepper, woof. It's really hot. So, mmm. This is nice. Nice. She's the one selling it. She's still in secondary school, so after school, she will go around and help her mom sell this. So you are doing a great job. Well done. Thank you. Hmm. Hmm. The inner part of the meat is the most delicious part. This is, we have rice, we have meat, and then, mm.
It's beautiful. It's lovely. Tasty. Johnson doesn't talk. He just focus on his food. You don't want them to know how delicious the food is. Mm. You see? Look at the hoy. That's the bump, man. This is what we crave for every day. I think I will need more meat. I love it. You don't. But you don't talk. That's good. This is how a lot of families sustain yourself. When growing up, we have a lot of friends like that that has up food one way or the other just to help their parents because they actually gonna have their stand. They have where they produce it, where they cook it, where they sell it. But just to, you know, more money, more customers. After school, she had to go around and find more customers. It's a way of helping your parents to get more money so that you can pay your school fees. Put food on your table, shelter and everything. Look at the egg. This is called Enito Muta. <laughs> egg soak inside the pepper. Mm. Mm. It's lovely. What's the name of that thing? This? Mm. Mm. I don't know. They call it Yoba. I mean, I think those in Yoba, they call it Unigbawe. Is this Unigbawe? Yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> uh, I need more meat, man. Find good five meat for me. This Put it somewhere. I'm bringing it. Five. Yeah, look at that one. I'm not talking about this one. I'm talking about that one. No. Mm -mm. This one. Yeah. I want in now. Give me two more in No, you know, not the shaki and everything. Uh, I mean, not the fuku and everything. Yeah, something like that. One more. You can give me that one more. Yeah. Let's try Como. We have egg, egg into mozza. We have meat. Mm. <laughs> I have a small mouth. Mm. <laughs> this is lovely. I know you guys miss this. If you are somewhere in abroad and you are not in Nigeria, 
When you bite on it, it actually explodes in your mouth. All the flavor and everything. Mm. This is the best outdoor food you can ever get. And if you're not eating this rice, that means you're eating our other rice. We have a local rice, a father. I've created a lot of content on it. You can stitch up it out. The last bite of the egg. Mm. And the last meat. Mm. Mm. It's lovely. Really lovely. This end is awesome. Wonderful street food, and don't worry, we're gonna be giving you more of street food to the end of this year, and we're gonna do some other grilling and everything. And after that, next year we're gonna start traveling again, start traveling, start going around, start hunting. We're definitely gonna do one or two hunting this year again. For you guys i love you have a wonderful day bye